What's up guys, it's Walsh here today and uh, we're not shooting today. I've got um, a video coming up right now. It's it's involved with one of my interests and it's uh, recently this building I found in Stone Market. Um, it's well hidden. There's like, it's uh, it is the, um, the Masonic Centre on uh, Violet Hill Road. Lodge number 5043. Um, has 61 members according to the Suffolk Freemasons website. But uh, yeah, I'm just about to show you where it is. And off we go. So right now I'm about to take a dog for a walk. Um, yeah, off we go. Um, the lodge is well hidden by two buildings. I don't know if it's part of the design or what. But um, I'll show you both sides. There's one, I can't remember the road. But it's straight up the road and there's this big, big house on the left hand side. The lodge is well hidden behind that. And there's um, the postcode takes you to a small house on the right. Sort of a private road goes all the way down. I'll show you when we get there, but uh, yeah, it's quite interesting. I'm just saying, if there's a lodge in the small town of Stone Market, there's a, probably a lodge wherever you are right now, and you probably don't even know about it. <laughs> so just literally Google it up on your county's Freemason website or whatever, find a lodge, and just you know get these places recorded. Smudge slowly. Diddle, you stay there. Stay in, Diddle. <laughs> diddle on your bed. Smudge out. Sit. Sit. Smudge. Sit. Sit. Stay. What's this, Smudge? In you get. Go on. In. <laughs> okay. Put that tree there. So here we are in my humble courser. <laughs> I have my keys on it. Turn that down. Very smudge. pages and the addresses etc all that stuff Yeah, 
he had a butchery on it, all the dogs. So yeah, he was a he was a mason. But anyway, obviously the bloodline went went cold and I don't know, don't know, don't know how it all happened. But I've always just known about the masons even before my mum told me. noticed it when I was walking past the nursery and it was sitting up right on the hill so yeah it's um it's, you know it's hard to get to but once you know where it is you can't really forget it's well hidden I don't know when the sort of extensions are already there on the lodge because well, actually, it's a hall. It's a hall. But there's ex sort of a big, two big buildings outside of it, and I don't know. I don't know what it's classified as really. I think it's just a Masonic hall. Uh, they have meetings and all sorts and stuff like that. Well, I'm not a Mason, so I'm not really bothered. <laughs> Good to get like an interview or something with a few of them. Oh, I beat him out. I bet I beat him out. Come on. Yeah. 
when I was first looking for it, Christy, I couldn't actually find it. We, we kept going up um, Fairfield Hill, this one up here on the left. And because number 33 is right on the corner of it, we thought, yeah, 33, Masonic numbers, got to have something to do with a lodge. But then we peered over a fence and we realised, ah, Ah, the lodge is well hidden behind this building. Park up along the side somewhere. Here. I'll just take my dog for a walk. Right. So here we are. Nine minutes. It took a while. Okay. Let me just turn you off for a second. So if we go. Morning, dead end, oh god. <laughs> be my dead end, wouldn't it? Yeah. Try not to act like an idiot. So this is the back of the lodge. Right there. This right here, this path. Is the back of the lodge. I'm not going up closer because it's someone's. Looks like someone's house, but it's not. I'll take the dog for a walk now. I'll pop up just up to the other side of. I uh, can't remember the name of the road, but watch. Come on. Smudge, come on. Poor little car. Oh, that's cute, isn't it? Yeah, that woman was coming out of the lodge. Not quite sure why. Could be, I don't know, anything. <laughs> but, um, yeah. So, I'll show you the, how, like, I saw, me and Christy saw how the lodge was connected to that house up on the corner there. Fairfield Hill, that's the one. Literally just up these stairs. And you can see the lodge. That house there. It's clearly connected to the lodge. So I'm going to run up along this side, right next to Poppy Children's Day Nursery. You can see the lodge up on the hill. Just there with the numbers on the, uh, not, no, the sign on the door and everything. And 
was running about. You walk up alongside them and put in. You can get better view. Won't stay long. Just here. There's the top of the lodge, you see it still. These gardens go straight up to the back of it. Smudge you idiot, come on. And then there's a private drive at the top of this hill. You can take you to it. And this building coming up, just literally right in front, is the building near lodge. <laughs> Can't breathe. Is the building the lodge is actually addressed to. So when you type in the Google or anything like that, you will stop outside. Down this pathway, on top of the hill. Now. This is nice in the car park. No, an authorised admission. <gasps> Scary. And right round there is you come st straight up to the door. thing is, <laughs> I did go over there, took a picture, I'll put it on this video, but uh, yeah, <laughs> saying, oh no, you can't do that, maybe if like, ever do become a mason, I won't be able to tell you, but anyway, <laughs> so yeah, um, <laughs> about that. I've been in the car park before, but didn't see a sign. No. <laughs> Unauthorised person. Oh God. Cry, cry, cry. I'm gonna burn my bowels or something. Evil. No, no jokes. Um, I don't know. It's a hard one. Hello, police station. That's cute. Back down this hill. Oh, dear. If I blow this, I'll probably get killed. <laughs> okay, so if you keep coming down this hill, you'll reach... I think it's Violet Hill Road or something, I don't know. Past the cemetery. Keep going down, take a right. And then take the next right. Then you're back at the car. Well, where I parked, anyway. And, uh... Yeah, this is the bottom of Violet Hill Road. Uh, that's where the cemetery is, obviously. That's what I can bring the camera up in my face so I don't look like an idiot now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, lodges are well hidden. Well, some are. That one is particularly hidden. 
And I keep saying it's a lodge and it's not a lodge, it's a hall. A meeting hall. Like all the meeting dates there are on the website. I'll link it in the bottom if you're interested to go take a look. You can volunteer to be a mason. I don't even know why. And uh yeah, <laughs> I don't know. It's difficult. It's, it's just something that we don't understand, but it's open and secret society. It's not like it's well hidden anymore. But I don't know. Who knows? I don't want to do a blood oath though, so I don't think I'll join. <laughs> so this is the road I go up, beach terrace, comes up to the back of the lodge where the main house bit is, I don't know. I'll show you like an aerial view of the lodge, put a picture on. I'll put a uh, Google link or something. In. Sort of, you know, if you live in the Stone Market area, share this video about Facebook or whatever, wherever I decide to put it. And uh, yeah, oh, now to drive back, I'm sweating out, it's hot out. So here we are, back in the quarter. Should have parked up the other end. I'm knackered. And thank you very much for watching. Be aware of lodges in your area. It's hot. I need to get running again. <laughs> Doing some type of sport. That right smudge. Oh, they take us off, I need to take off. <laughs> so, yeah, keep an eye out for lodges in your area if you're interested. Find me on Twitter at CGC, capitals underscore, and capitals Walshy put that up on the screen I'm sweating out I'm gonna die business dog walking sitting and boarding if you got a dog and you're in stow look for the dog father Jesus it's hot and uh yeah <laughs> about the Masons. I used to be really into conspiracy and stuff like that. But there's always a possibility and I don't know, you can't tell who's telling the truth. 
Bruce fear mongering. I don't know. So it's hard to judge. I suppose. Road to go to one us, no one house, one house, number one, one house. And he said, when are you going to upload? And I thought, you know what? I'll upload a little bit of a video. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I live in the Suffolk area, obviously. Stone Market. <laughs> the one house signs, lovely, great. Yeah, this is the old one house village. Probably can't see any of it because I've got the camera the wrong way around, like a bell end. Right turn down Northfield Road. Then you take a left turn down I'm an idiot. Ash Road. There you go. Here's Ash Road. Lovely. Yeah. Oh, oh. hello, Van. How you doing, mate? Blocking the road. Thank you. Thank you. Here, the number 45. Oh dear. Yeah, don't be afraid of what you put on the internet. You're gonna get haters and you're gonna get people say, oh you can't put this up. Oh, it's private property, you can't film it. But you know. When it's such a big thing like the Masons and there's information out there but it's information they provide so it's not really 
it's probably good information and masons are humans too but they've done a blood oath and I haven't so that's the difference um, <laughs> I would love if masons could get in contact with me and uh, I don't know we could probably share something and I could learn something and you could probably just tell me everything you know <laughs> and um, yeah thanks for watching this video I might make more like it depends if the masons come and kill me in my sleep uh, <laughs> and uh, Smudge, are you gonna are you gonna say goodbye? Are you gonna say goodbye, Smudge? No, I don't think she is. She's a dog. Why am I talking to a dog? It's just a when these big old black vans just pulling up and realise that I've just been filming the lodge. Gonna come in and kill me now. I'm gonna cry. Alright, okay. Have a good one guys, and I'll see you next time. Peace! Oh shit, I'm in. Bye!